Hello and welcome back to the Wild Wee! <laughs> Hello and welcome back to part two of this Victoria's top tips of photography. Um, I am still in France, so bonjour and bienvenue. Uh, it's beautiful here, so I try and do as much as I can from France. Eric is just over there with mud all over his face because he's a little chocolate muffin. I have a confession to make. Um, I originally thought, <laughs> twigs attacking me. I originally thought I'd only have two parts to my top tips. But, 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 there's always a but. But, um, as I was going through my top tips, uh, I kind of made more, and now I've got like four parts, so this might be a four-parter. But they're all important, they're not just like, oh, I'm gonna get more tips so I can make more videos. I ain't got time for that. Um, <laughs> it's actual useful tips. Uh, I hope you enjoy it, and I hope they're helpful, which they will be. I don't put stuff that's not helpful. Right, let's crack on. Let's go to top tip number un, un, one. Okay, so my top tip number one is RTFM. If you don't know what that means, read the flipping manual like on YouTube. <laughs> um, read your manual. Whatever you bought, whatever equipment, whatever camera, it doesn't matter. Read the manual. If you need to, watch YouTube videos. They're really helpful to have a walkthrough how to set up your camera. I know it's boring. Trust me. I really don't like reading manuals. I don't like reading stuff. I just like to go, yeah, get out of the box and run away with it. I'm like, woo, new equipment. But <laughs> you'll miss something out. So if you can, contain that excitement, contain it, and read the manual. Just read the manual. Top tip number one, read the manual. <laughs> Top tip number two is, slightly creepy one, well it sounds creepy, always look behind you. <laughs> what I mean by this is, I'm currently walking into this forest here, down there, I'm looking into the forest, but bam, what's behind me, it's a mountain. So you may have an idea of what something looks like as you're going towards it, but sometimes you can miss the most stunning pictures. They're right behind you. Just give it a sneaky peeky, cheeky look. <laughs> Take the quick one and just make sure you're not missing something incredible. Because as many times I've looked behind, I've been like, what? And then it's something amazing. So always look behind you. Okay, so my next tip. And this is my top tip for this section because it's something I always do wrong. Ugh, the amount of times I've done this, I want to kick myself. So if you've been out, you've got all your equipment ready and you're like, yeah, you go out on a nice hike. You're out and about, you've been out for like an hour, get in your bag, you're like, oh, I'll take a picture now. Get in your bag, turn the camera on. Camera goes, no SD card. You're like, oh, and then you check your bag no SD cards in your bag Ooh. and I've done that so many times I've been out like on a proper hike that I wanted to do photography on and I've forgotten my SD cards and I know if you're like me I have really bad memory I do it's a problem <laughs> and I do I easily forget my SD cards I forget loads of things but I have forgotten my SD cards so many times so how I get around this how I avoid this is that I always leave a spare SD card in my bag so whatever you do just leave one hidden away in there because you will get a moment where you forget your SD card and you'll be like, I've got one in my bag. <laughs> so leave an SD card hidden in your bag. That's my top tip number three. Don't forget it. Okay, so my next tip. One that comes from the heart, this one, because it says a lot about me as a person. <laughs> I am a rebel at heart, I am. I love breaking rules, I love doing things differently, I, have, I love unconvention, I love finding my own path and doing my own things. This is why in photography, it comes to this rule, I always say, don't compare. Don't ever compare your pictures to anyone else or what they do. And this isn't to say anyone else doesn't do beautiful pictures, 
They do. There's loads of amazing photographers in the world. But that's what makes it amazing, is that everyone does their own thing. So yeah, that's my top tip to you, is to be you. Do not compare your pictures to anyone else. Um, don't stump out your creativity by comparing your pictures to anyone else. It's very easy online to go, how did they get that picture? What am I doing wrong? No, no, you're not doing anything wrong. You are creating your own art and that is beautiful. So don't stop creating because you think you need to be like anyone else. Because if we all do that, we're all going to end up with the same pictures. We need difference, we need variety. So you keep bringing that variety by being you and doing you. Don't copy anyone else. Don't compare your work to anyone else. Appreciate your own creative impulses and your eye for difference because the world needs more difference. So keep that eye, keep that difference, keep your uniqueness and keep taking pictures in a way that you see it. Uh, yeah, that's my top tip number four. Be you, don't compare. Okay, and my final point, which links to my last point very well actually. It's like I did it deliberately. <laughs> okay, my final point is, as I said in the last one, break the rules. Do not worry about the rule of this. You must do photos like this. No, don't worry about that. <laughs> really don't. Do you think artists go, oh, I have to paint my picture like this? No, that's how you get new, amazing pieces of art coming out because people are just going, nah, I'm gonna do something different. So that's what you need to do with your photography <laughs> is be you, break the rules, forget about the rule of whatever and just do what you see. If you see a picture and you're like, yeah, I really like that, that calls to me, take it. Because it's your art, that's what photography is. It's what you want to do, it's your stamp. It's like saying, yeah, this is me. This is what I want to do. So break those rules, do more things that are different create your own rules how about that one did you ever think of that yeah <laughs> instead of breaking rules you could be starting something completely new so that's how innovation is done that's how new things are made is by not following the crowd so break those bloody rules break them because they were made to be broken otherwise we'd just be robots what's the point we're not robots we're humans so you keep breaking those rules. You do your photography as you want, what calls to you and what you like to do. And if someone doesn't like it, well, guess what? They don't have to look at it. There you go. <laughs> so yeah, break those rules. Top tip number five. And you make sure you break them. Break them good. Yeah, break them. Okay, I've calmed down a bit now. I got a bit excited. <laughs> it's because I'm a rebel at heart and at nature. And I just like to... Mm, do my own thing. So yes, I hope you've enjoyed these top tips. I hope they help you in your photography. Um, there'll be more on the way because I can't help it. I just, my mind goes off on one. It's like, oh, let's get more tips. So <laughs> um, yeah, I've got loads on the way. <laughs> but if I could just leave you with anything and it's the main focus and this whole vibe of this top tip is to do your own thing don't ever compare don't ever think less of your work um, because you've looked at someone else's because it's not like that it's not how it is appreciate other people's work say well done but you do your own thing because everyone takes beautiful pictures everyone has their own beautiful eye to photography and we need more of that so don't ever compare yourself don't be knocked don't let seeing other pictures knock your creativity or your drive to do photography you keep being you keep doing you keep breaking those rules and just follow your heart that's the main thing and you'd be amazed where it takes you because it's you and it's your expression and that's important so don't ever put that down um, yeah okay so stay you make sure you do stay awesome stay wild the trees stay free and until next time my lovely rebels. Goodbye for now. Bye-bye. Trust me. Okay, let's walk down here. It's very slippy. I've been down now. Tripod on the fence. Okay, that was a nice noise. <laughs> Just had to turn around because it's a mountain bike track. <laughs> and oh, I tried to be able to walk more. 
Did you break the rules? Did you get mud on your face and your back and you've got sticky things on you? Hey, you're doing it. You're breaking everything. You break those rules. Give me a book for breaking the rules. Book it, yeah, that's so good. Give me a high five. High five it for breaking the rules. Yeah, just like breaking the rules. Breaking the law, breaking the law. I ain't breaking the law. <laughs>